God heal my sick body. I used to wear a back brace. Jesus healed my body in Harlem Hospital when I was eight years old. The doctor said I posed to been dead. Now look at me. I can leap for joy. Why? Because Jesus healed me. And God healed me. He can heal you too. Some of y'all want to commit suicide. Some of y'all are broken hearted because you had no family. Your mother cursed you out. Your father cursed you out. But God will never curse you out. God wants to bless you today. And I'm not talking about money. You can have money and still be miserable. Rich folk are killing themselves and they got money taking drug overdoses. Get the Holy Ghost and not a drug overdose. Woo! Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Whoa, thank you, Jesus. Because Jesus is coming again for our holy people. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. There's certain friends you may have to cut off when you follow Jesus. Some of you are holding on to your friends who don't want to follow Jesus. When you follow Jesus, there's certain girlfriends and boyfriends you're going to have to cut off. If they don't love God, you follow God. If your family don't want God, you get God. If your wife don't want God, you get God for yourself. If your husband don't want him, you get God. Because we all going to stand before God individually for ourselves. If they want to sell drugs, you don't sell no drugs. Don't follow the wrong crowds. A lot of us need to cut our friends off because they're doing the wrong thing. The Bible said huh, to come out from among them huh, and be separated. Some of y'all found the wrong crowd. You can be a good person, but guess with the wrong crowd. You can have a good heart, but God bless you, brother. Happy to see you today. There's a great plan for your life. God bless my brothers right there. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus, and my sisters. There's certain wrong crowds we got to cut off. You can be a good person, but just hanging with the wrong crowds. Got the wrong friends who you think that's your friends, but they're stabbing you in the back. Jesus is your friend who seeks us closer than a brother. Hallelujah. Praise God. I praise God for the Prince of Peace. I don't want to die and go to hell. If you think this sun is hot, hell is a trillion times more hotter than the sun. Hallelujah. I want to go to heaven to be with Jesus. There's a place better than this world. It's called paradise. In order to get to heaven, we got to be holy. That's why God said, be holy, for I am holy. Heaven is not just only a wonderful place, but heaven is a holy place. All to get to heaven, we got to be holy because Jesus is holy. Now, we're not perfect. I know I am perfect. That's why I need God to help me live holy. And say, Lord, forgive me for my sins. Tell your wife, I'm sorry for beating on you. Tell your husband, I'm sorry for cheating on you. Stop being a child molester. Don't lust after your daughter, lust after your wife. Sex offenders are going to hell. Child molesters are going to hell. Murderers are going to hell. Liars are going there. But if you repent, Jesus can forgive us for our sins. Why? Because God is love. God is still love. He doesn't love the wrong we do, but he loves you. God ain't racist. He loves the whites and the blacks. He just hates the racism. God doesn't like all this hatred. The Bible said, love one another as Christ had loved you. It's not easy to love in a world like this. It ain't easy to love in a world like this. Because so much evil in the world. But thank God for Jesus Christ. He can protect you. <laughs> There's still a hope. In spite of this coronavirus, there's still a hope. Jesus is a great hope. God bless you, brother. God bless you. Hallelujah. You sound good on that trumpet. Amen. You sound good on that trumpet. Praise God. Hallelujah. In spite of the coronavirus, it's still a hope. You sound good on that trumpet. Woo! Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus.